are lined up, official ready to drop the puck. The Bruins take possession to get this one underway. Moves it quickly over to Lindholm. Taken by Pasternak. Gets his stick on it. Denies him! The Kraken have taken possession along the wall. Knocked away with the stick by McAvoy. Hammers him in the open ice. He knew exactly what he was Looking doing at that Two on one. Gains the zone. Passes it over. Oh, and they can't complete the play. Here's the pass. And it turns off a twig in front of the net. Marchand's got it across the line. Here's a feed in front. And he slides it quickly to Larson. And he slides it quickly to Tobin. He's got a step. Big time save. He was dialed in there. Well, he has the benefit of seeing it coming here, James. So he gets himself set to position he anticipates. I think he has a book on the shooter, to be truthful. And he makes a save. Tanev stick handling in his own zone. And here's the pass to Gore. Uses the force on that hit. Tender to anticipate and get across to make that save. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. The Bruins lead it 1 0. McCann's got it, and they'll go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Oh, what a slick stop by Crusoe! You have to be quick in your crease if you want to be able to deny low zone shots. He does that perfectly as he's tight to the shooter right there. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Directed over to Frederick. Takes the feed. Here's a shot. Oh, what a stop on the play. Pass to Bjorkstrand. Cuts into the paint. Takes a shot. Turns that one away. Great reflexes. Another save. On the sequence of saves, I love how strong he is in his set position here, James. You can see that he gets square to the shooter, and that makes the second save easier. Stop by the goaltender, getting a piece of that one. Passes over to Dunn. From along the boards, moves the puck ahead. McCann's got it in the offensive zone. Quick feed to McAvoy. Here they come on the rush. And that's poked away by Larson. Seattle's got possession at center. Puts it in deep. From behind the net. Chance in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Right away. Oh, he's Shot, and he sees an opening and he takes it. 
The Bruins look to be on a mission tonight, already up by two here, and we're still only in the first. Well, the mission is possible because they've been dominant out there tonight, James. They've been relentless. They competed for pucks, loose pucks at will. I mean, they've outbattled their opponent, and now they're sitting with a two-goal cushion. to Sidora. Can't get a hold of that pass. Boston's got it in their own zone. Sends a pass over. Oh, makes the save. That was a rocket. Slides the puck down low. Dishes it off with authority. Poked away by Sidora. Carrying the puck deep inside his own end. Carlos got it in the defensive end. Slides the puck to Sidora. The Kraken have taken over in the neutral zone. Sends it into the offensive zone. And he takes the feed. Boston's gained the line and into the zone. Denies him, he got all of it. Goaltender covers up and will get a face off. Just here in the late stages of this frame, Boston's really controlled the pace of play these last few minutes, leading by two. Stevenson's won a big draw on their own end. Puck grab by Coyle. Nice hit on the play there. And that's knocked away. Quick pass to McAvoy. Oh, and some smooth skating to lose the defender there. And that's deflected. And it's a quick pass to Lindholm. Turns him away. Picked up along the wall by Coyle. Again, the denial by the goaltender. And he loses control of the puck. And makes the routine save. Tolbin has gained the line and on the attack. And with that, the first period is in the books. Both teams with a chance and a refresh. We'll get a clean sheet of ice and come back with period number two. We are about ready to get underway here for the second period. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. Well, Cheryl, how do you sum this one up for the first 20 minutes? The Bruins staff have to be impressed with their start, James. I mean, they have a healthy two-goal lead heading into the second period here. They need to continue to do what they were doing through the first, and that's getting shots on net. Boston's been rewarded for putting pucks on net here early in the second. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Play is whistled dead as the puck goes up and over. We're still in the early stages of this period. The Bruins lead this one to zip. Boston's got the puck inside the offensive zone. Seattle's got it in their own zone. Shot! Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps it at bay. The Bruins move the puck in the defensive zone. And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. Centering feed. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Feeds it over. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Dropped him in the open ice. Neutral zone now, picking up steam. Moves it to Kiki. Reads it perfectly in the defensive end. Unable to reach that one. All alone. Moves it to the middle. And he denies that great opportunity there. Alexiak's moving it ahead. They've got numbers here. And he makes a save there. Corpusalo is going to keep and hang on for the whistle. And just slow it down a little bit here. Now the goaltender, he always has to be mentally focused and ready to make a save, James. He hasn't been busy this period, but they're in the lead, so it's a safe play. He elects to hold on. Coyles won the draw here in their own zone. Boston's looking to break out. Here's a short pass to Saka. And the puck departs the zone. Boston's in on the offensive attack now. Moves it to the middle. And Changes direction because it 
deflects off of a defender in front. Real tough puck luck. So far in this game, James, they've owned possession times. It really has been a clinic in terms of possession and creativity in the offensive zone. The coach will certainly be talking about maintaining their good defensive habits when they do lose the puck, though. When you have it a lot, you can often cheat on the other side of it. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Seattle's game possession along the boards. Huge stop by Cropasolo. Handles the pass from his goalie. Quattro's moving the puck through his own zone. On the attack along the boards. Here's a pass down low. That's some smart heads up defensive play by Schwartz. Boston's looking to break out of their own end. They've got some momentum here. Sorry pass. And that's stopped. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Pokes it away in his own end. Boston's got a hold of it along the wall. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. Seattle's got the puck along the wall. And that's intercepted by Middleton. Scoops up the puck now. Moves it quickly over to Kostelik. Swing and a miss. Seattle's got the puck in their own end. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Oh, how did that stay out? What a save by Gacorn. Boston's dominated right from the start. Their offense clicking on all cylinders, and they lead here in the second. The Bruins win that offensive zone faceoff. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. over. Looking to make something happen along the boards. The Kraken have gained possession off the wall. Quick feed to Montour. And he takes the dish. Moves into the slot. Taken along the wall by Corbin. From the slot, wrist shot. Big time stop there. Passes it over. And he hits one of his own teammates with that shot. And just like that, comes up with the puck. Great little flick of the stick. Knocked away. The Kraken have it in their own zone. Alexiak's taking it from his own end. The Bruins gain control of the puck. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Receives the pass. Hangs on to the puck after taking a hit. Moves the puck down low. Scooped up along the wall by Middleton. Takes a shot. Oh, how did he stop that one? Wow! From the slot. Big time stop. Seattle's got it behind the net. Slides it over with pace to Alexiak. Intercepts it in the neutral zone. Four seconds left. And that's broken up. 
brings the second period to an end. Both teams will go back to their rooms and get a quick breather. Well, man, there's a lot of fans looking forward to this intermission action coming up here. Fun entertainment in store, and we've got the third period coming up in moments. Still the fourth period here. Last chance to try to get back into it in what has been a dominant affair so far. Well, two periods down. Here we go with the third period. Cheryl, your assessment so far. Boston's been dominant through two periods of play, James. They have a comfortable lead now, and the coach can look down their bench and say, hey, listen, let's get everyone out there. Let's maintain the energy. Let's finish this off right. Let's bring it home. Moves it around along the half wall. Marchand's going to play into the corner. And that goes off the glove. Play continues here. As a goaltender, you want to make yourself as big as possible, and that's exactly what he does right there and just takes away the net. Boston's offense has been a thing to watch tonight as they lead it big time here early in the third. The Bruins win the faceoff. And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. Veneers crosses the line and is on the attack. Turned aside with the club by Kupasalo. And he passes up ahead to Saka. Seattle's moving it up the ice. And just a good old-fashioned solid body check on the play. Here they come. Down the left side on the attack. Fires it on net. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Now the shooter's going to run out of real estate because he does a great job of getting out of top of the crease and taking away all the room. When you make yourself as big as possible, there's less holes in the net. Puck said down the ice. We'll get an icing. Zaka has been feeling it, James. You know who else is feeling it? His teammates. They have been the beneficiaries of a great leader on the ice who's just been distributing the puck and generating a ton of offense. Passes the puck over to Kiki. Quick pass to Stevenson. Oh, it's still out! It's still out! What a save! Well, that's all Will, and this is going to elevate his team. No question about it, James. I mean, it was all but in, and then he comes from nowhere to make that save. Well, as play continues, can you feel the love tonight? Listen to this place here, Cheryl. I can feel it, you can feel it, and he can feel it after that last save. Because you know what fans appreciate? They appreciate effort, James, and that's how that save was made. Dumps it into the ozone. Oh, just a textbook hit. Icing is the call. We'll get a face off at the other end. Boston's put in a total team effort here this evening, and they lead it comfortably in the third. Stevenson's won the face off, and now let's see what they can do. The coach and team reminding each other that this is a critical face off. Anytime you've got your opponent on their heels after an icing, you have to find a way to have urgency and attack. Takes a lot, but still hangs on. Slides the puck over. Slides it across. Makes the save. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Nearing the midway mark of the period, the Bruins lead it 4-0. They have dominated. Seattle's going to start with the puck inside the offensive zone. Sacrifices the body to block that in front. And now it's grabbed by Lysel. Toss up the puck after that hit. Taken by Gordon. Boston's defended extremely well throughout this game, whether it's the neutral zone or into their own zone as well. They pushed everything to the perimeter, a reason why the goaltender is staring down a shutout right now. Toronto's up next on the schedule. Tickets still available. Go to the box office, or you can get them online. The Bruins have been the aggressor offensively tonight as they continue to lead in the third. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Tosses it on to Zadora. Moves it up through the middle from the right. Rashad's been fantastic tonight, James, and he has a goal. Oh, and right after that, he's jumping in here. Ah, teamwork, James. Jumping in for your star player. You know everyone on that bench wanted this to happen, and it did. And that'll do it after that one. I know who you're fighting, and he landed a perfect one right there and took him down. 
Sometimes when you're getting blown out and you're upset and you're frustrated, you're sending a message to your team as well. You're sending a message like, hey, we gotta finish this one strong. We gotta send a message for the next time we meet. Well, both teams seem to be a little calmer now after a pretty chaotic stretch just a few moments ago. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Stop that one. Gains the zone from the right side. Tanev's got it deep in the offensive end. There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. Boston's offense has been the story tonight, leading big time here in this third period. Seattle's got it, and they're on the attack. Let's get the call. Coyle's going to serve a pair for interference. And the power play unit takes to the ice their first chance to try to make something happen in this game. They haven't scored on the power play yet, but they have another opportunity. The key to this one, gain possession so they can set up. Slides the puck down low. Deport's got the puck, and he's going to hang on. McCann's ready to take the draw here on this power play. Frederick's got it. Now they'll look to see what they can do with it offensively. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Seattle's got a hold of the puck. And he takes the feed and makes the save. Moves the puck. Here he is, takes the shot. Comes up with a stop. Great read by the keeper to poke it away. Well, James, that puck is distributed perfectly. It's sitting nice and flat, and the shooter just loves it. Gets all of it, but the goaltender makes a great save. Picking up Steve. He's got a step. What a save by the Timney there. Well, he's exuding a ton of confidence, not sitting back in his neck. Challenges and make the save. Gord's ready for the draw as we get set to resume this power play. The Bruins win it. And there's a shot. Things start to get a little physical out there. Quick feed to Cartier. Moves the puck along the half wall. Keeps a hold of it on the play. Shot tipped in front. And a great save. Now a quick pass to Marchand. They gain the zone from the left side. The Bruins take it along the wall. Hammers the shot. Face off coming up as the puck goes up and over the glass. Kiki's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. Lays into the body on the play. From the point, they take control of it. Shakes off the coverage. Here he is with the backhander. Move it in. And he loses 
loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Moves it quickly over to McAvoy. The Bruins will play it in their own end. Sedina's got the puck. Scoops up the puck. Oh, what a save in front. Grubauer has been consistent over the course of his career, mainly because of his positioning, James. He gets sent to that puck square to it and makes the save. Shuts him down. Grabbed along the board by Bjorkstrand. Poked away in the defensive end. Boston's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Big time stop there. The well, goaltender has to be able to anticipate the play, and he does just that. Gets square to the shooter in the low slot and makes the save. Here's a short pass to Montour. With possession along the wall. Inside of the final minute here in the third. Answered the call there. Quick feed to Coyle. Oh, what a close save by Corpusello. The legs to play the puck. Takes the feed. Dishes it off. Denies him in close. When the puck's in the low slot, the goaltender gets right out next to the shooter and makes the save. Feeds the puck to Carlo. And we're going to breather here with outside the call. The Bruins offense has paid off in dividends tonight. No short of the scoring chances of being capitalized on that. Won the draw in the neutral zone. Slides the puck over to Lysa. And he makes the save. And as the final seconds kick off the clock, the home fans acknowledging what they just saw tonight. Handles the puck.